Well, crowds are gathering outside the courthouse, including a handful of protesters on both sides of this highly controversial, highly emotional case. Let's talk a little bit about what's going to go on inside the courthouse. The former president will travel here from Trump Tower. He will surrender to authorities and be formally arrested. No handcuffs, but he will be read his rights and fingerprinted. Then agents will take him to a courtroom for his arraignment on what sources tell us will be around 30 charges in this case. Uh, details of those charges, exactly what he'll be facing, which counts, we'll know after the arraignment. The entire court process will only take take a few minutes and then the former president says he is headed straight back to Florida where he will at some point later this evening discuss the day's events that will happen at Mar-a-Lago. We do expect to also hear from New York's district attorney, the man bringing these charges, Alvin Bragg. In fact, he is scheduled to discuss the case during a press briefing just after the arraignment. Now we'll continue to monitor things here on the ground. Get back to you with the latest. For now, though, I'm Jay Gray in New York.